Hey y'all, KB here, and welcome back to another episode of Skyrim. We're actually in Solstheim. <laughs> so, <clears throat> we ended right here with... Oh no, where'd he go? Oh, derp, right there. He was hiding. He was camouflaged. Um, <laughs> we're... we're uh, we poked through the tunnel into this big old cavern and the arrow's pointing right at it. Clearly this is where we needed to get to, but now we just need to get down without croaking. So let's do some hopping. We're good not to crouch anymore. Ah, yes. There are bodies all over the place. Let's start at the end here and work our way in. Ooh, ooh. Oh, looky there. I'm so glad we decided to go to the end. Search here. Steel Warhammer. Nothing super awesome. But it's all. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, it's okay. You, I, I probably bumped into you. You're good. Milius. Oh, no. Iron Mace of Swords. Now, is Milius the... I don't think Milius was the, um... Grandpa. Of the Crescious guy that we talked to. Is it? No, no Gratian Crelius. There we go. He sold all still some folk of bread. But as a Nord... All right, Gratian, what do you have on you? <gasps> a blood skull blade. Look at this thing. It's fantastic. You can't look at it because I just took it. Okay. Well, hang on. We got goodies over here. Doggies over there. Because they're idgits. That's impressive. Hang on. Okay. Hopefully they'll be quiet for a couple more minutes. All right. All right. This place is crazy. Vilkas agrees. Let's clear the draugr of their money. Oh, burnt corpse. Bone meal. Thank you. Oh, no. This guy. Hey. Five gold is five gold. Nobody in that one. Oh, we got one more over here. Okay, now we need to read that very special journal. Cool. Okay, Gratian, I would appreciate it if you could help us with the situation we've encountered in Raven Rock. It seems that the miners there have stumbled across some sort of ruins under the surface near Shaft 3, and we need your expertise to take a look. I could send someone else if you're busy, but I figured you'd want to go, since I seem to recall that you're originally from Solstheim. Let us know if you make any progress. Rendelius Thandarian. Rendelius Thandarian. East Empire Company, Imperial City, Cyrodiil. Well, I think he made some progress. Journal. Okay. Received a letter from the East Empire Company today. They say that some of the miners broke through the wall in the shaft three of in shaft three of Raven Rock Mine and found some ruins. I hope this isn't another, another waste of time like that fiasco they sent me to in Cyrodiil. I gathered my assistant Milius, and I will gather and sail back to Raven Rock first light. It's, it'll be nice to see that old house in Soul's time again. Finally arrived in Raven Rock and was surprised at the number of dark elf refugees living in town. They aren't really from mining stock, but I think they'll make fine workers one day. Milius and I spent a good part of the day clearing the ash off the roof of my house. Damn volcano is still erupting almost day and night. If it wasn't for the ash covering everything, it would look almost beautiful. Milius and I are heading into Raven Rock Mine to have a look at whatever it is in mines uncovered. I think I'll stop at the old swing and scoop and pick up a few supplies before we head down. Couldn't hurt to be prepared. Looks like the miners broke right through the wall of an old Nordic barrow. 
I've seen this sort of thing in Skyrim before. Damn Nords have burrows dotting the landscape and almost none of them are ever marked on any maps. Looks like this burrow belongs to something called the Bloodskull Clan. I'm going to take some rubbings of the inscriptions on the tombs and see if I can't learn some more information from my history books. It's been a few days and I can't find even a single mention of this clan anywhere. Milius and I decided to proceed ahead. We've come to a drop down point, but I can see a massive chamber below. It took the better part of a day to lower everything down and climb down the almost sheer drop. It's been an astonishing day of discovery. After exploring the large chamber beyond the drop off, I was startled to find the strangest weapon I've ever laid eyes upon sitting on a pedestal of sorts. The blade appears to be flawless and is emitting a faint chilling glow. Bits of parchment I found about the chamber seem to call this the Blood Skull Blade. Not certain if I should remove it yet. I think I'll sleep on it. Ooh. I've decided against my own better judgment to remove the Blood Skull Blade from its pedestal. Milia seems completely against it, but we need to bring this wondrous artifact with us when we find a way out of the borrow. I should have listened to Milius. The moment the blade was lifted, we were set upon by Draugr. Milius fought bravely, but he fell. I was able to destroy the maining ones, but I was badly wounded. I can barely stand. My only chance would be finding a way out of this place, but I fear that I'm trapped. Exploring has been slow. I can only move for maybe a few minutes at a time before I have to rest. My supplies are running low, and I'm feeling weaker by the hour. The only progress I've made is finding a strange door with markings on it that I've never seen. There appears to be something to them I'm missing as they've confounded my attempts at getting through. I'll have to study this further in order to make any progress, barely can keep awake. I'm fairly certain that the key to the door involves the use of the blood skull blade. When swinging the weapon, I'm noticing a ribbon of mystical energy emanating from it. I think by swinging the sword in different directions, it's possible to manipulate this ribbon and solve whatever puzzle this door presents. I hope to get well enough to put this to the test soon. Each swing is a huge effort. Last entry. I've lost track of time and my strength is fading. I can't even stand anymore. My wounds refuse to heal. I'm afraid this tomb will become my resting place. If anyone finds this journal, please send these notes to my superiors at the East Empire Company and tell my wife that I love her. May RK guide me to my final rest. That sucks! Alright, so let's equip this blade. The Blood Scar Blade. And it is a two-handed weapon. Whoa, it looks so cool. Oh, yeah! <laughs> okay. So... Oh! See that? Okay. Um... power attack, but I don't know how to do... Okay. One final shot down the middle should do it. Oh, snapdragons. Well, 
Of course it is. Some of my own they might. Hey, Vilkas, I need to check something with you. Okay, so 23. Oh, I didn't derp. Um, Vilkas. What can I help you with? Um. Oh, yeah, can you cook me something? want you going into a fight on an empty stomach. I'll have another meal ready tomorrow. Isn't that sweet? I need to trade you some stuff. Glad to help however I can. Okay. Wuthrad. 28. Additional 20% against the elven races. Now, we are in Raven Rock, so you would think that there would be a greater number of elven races here, especially in the Dark Elves. Okay, but 28 versus 23. Alright, you stick with Wuthrod, buddy. I swear he's hopeless. I seem to be fairly hopeless too, but... check around these back runes here. Alright, that's the way out. But, but, we need to figure out what's up here. And I would really like to have Vilkas, oh, at least he's close. Ish. on me. Heal other. I would need heal other. Oh well. We got a word wall. Probably. Yeah, probably. Oh, there's the trouble. Okay, so here's the thing with um, dragon priests on soul's time. They, oh. They have their own um, masks here on Soul's Time. Um, okay, let's do that. And do a little bit of extra bow. Um, and we'll, t we'll damage his magicka. Ah! Sorry. And then we need... We'll do that. There, so now... Probably get me. Oh, you sneaky devil, you. Yeah, but see. As long as I don't hit Vilkas, we're good, I think. Oh! He's so sneaky! I just shoot Velkas. Y'all darn it. Oh, hi. All right, that's it. Like beat him with my shield for a little bit because, well, 
He wasn't doing any damage for a while. But see? Okay, increases shock resistance by 50% shock spell. Wonderful! We're not gonna do that, but it's nice to have. Give me the word, wall! Give me the word! Give me the word! Dragon Aspects! Love Dragon Aspect, you guys. It is one of my absolute favorite shouts. Which you can only get on this, on Soul Time. We we swim, we swim. Now, I think this was empty, right? Oh no. Oh, it had two gold in it. Yeah, just getting up here uh, spawns that dude. So. All right, well, this is the way out, but this? A black book? With, what, a kraken on it? Winds of change. What the Indeed. You guys, this so, is Apocrypha. Another seeker at the knowledge enters my realm. I am Hermaeus Mora, Prince of Fate and Lord of Secrets. This is Apocrypha, where all knowledge is hoarded. See, these are all books yeah. around me. Perhaps it's all knowledge. You will prove clever enough to uncover the secrets hidden here. If so, welcome. <laughs> Perhaps you are a fool or a coward. If so, you are in peril. Need your book again, and you state before Apocrypha claims you forever. Mm -mm. Well, we're no coward. All right, started. Black Buck Winds of Change. So I could read the book right now, and it would send me exactly back to where I was. But there are rewards to be had for getting through this um, Black Book. Now, towers and towers of books. Crazy sculptures, very, very bad tentacles, and that black water is not friendly. So we're gonna go through here. gonna find some new enemies and some new stuff we will learn oh wrong button seeker Shooting with a bow is getting kind of slow here. I'm thinking we might as we might just need to bum rush him. Over the edge. Darn it. Okay, we're gonna pretend that never happened. You didn't see anything. We're gonna read the book again. We're gonna get back in there. The winds of change. That is right. No kidding. But See, this is where Where is he? Oh, 
I killed him. That's right, because I saw as I was falling. There's his remains down there. I could search him, and they do have really good stuff on them, usually. Um, you can get skill, skill books like crazy in here. Um, but... Oh, lots of soul gems, lots of books. Um, there's goodies to be had. But, um... Yeah, they have good stuff on them. But I'm not going after that guy because I will fall to my death if I do. Ascribe. Cool. Something deadly that way. <laughs> See, look at these grand soul gems. And occasionally you'll find chests that don't look right. And these pods with wonderful goodies. Um, what else can you find in here? Um, we can also... Oh, there you are. See, I wish, and your follower cannot, um, follow you in here, but I wish that I had some sort of conjuration thing so that it could take some of my, um, it could take some of the attention off of me. Seeker remains. See, okay, so we have scrolls and and goodies, but yeah, I just want it to take some of the attention off of me so that I could, um, there, so that I can, like, shoot from afar or whatever. So we need to buff up our bow. Maybe throw a, some extra fire enchantment on it or something. Is it even enchanted? Let me look real quick. Um, oh, 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 okay. Charge. There we go. Okay. Let's just show that. And my sword does 33. Which is good. It is good, I'll give it that. Okay, we activated the scry. Ooh, that's right. Lurkers. Isn't he cute? Oh shoot, I didn't think he could come all the way in here. So you know what I'm gonna do? I don't have anything active. Ah! Okay. Well, oh, this way. What we need to do, let's um... Let's give him a fire breath. Let's give him some fire breath. Here, Yo! take this. Okay, so he is stuck right here. Perfect. We're gonna take advantage of this. Absolutely. Until he comes at us. Through the door. If he keeps being stuck. We're gonna take advantage of the glitch. Go for it. Whoop, whoop. Critical. Love it. How about the face hole? Let's get some in the face hole. We, uh, we might be a little... You know, I don't think we're too low on the levels to be fighting these guys. I don't know. I think we're good. I think that they would level with us. All right, now let's do some close to combat, shall we? Don't step on me, that's rude. Soul captured. And, ooh, Ring of the Night increases heavy armor. 300 bucks, whoop whoop. I'll say that's quite a haul. All right, so this being our very first book, I do believe that the um, 
it's a bit shorter than some of the others. There are, I think, five different black books on Souls Time. I think, I think, I do believe. Alright, scrolls, ruined books, look at this scroll. If we don't use it, we can sell it. Scroll of Frenzy, that, oh, that was a black, yeah, black soul gems. Oops, and there we go, two-handed. Black soul gems, as you know, um, hold the largest souls. always good. Oh yeah, see here's the end. Oh, here's another chest or a vessel. <sighs> so there are a lot of books in here that you can only get here. All right. Completed. Now, once you complete a book, you get to choose a blah, 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 blah. you get to choose a perk. So what is this one? Okay, lovers insight do ten percent more damage and get ten percent better prices from the opposite sex. Your attacks, shouts, and destruction spells do no damage to your followers. Huge one. And scholars insight. Reading skill books give you an extra skill point. Mm. Problem is, I don't know like how far we are with reading all of our skill books. And if we've read about half of our skill books, then that's kind of not worth it. God, they're all good, but I am going to go with this one because I'm always going to be having a companion. And this would be great to not have to cause them any damage. And then, back to Souls time. And we will go right back to Vilkas where we left off. Where we died. Did you see what just happened? What can I help you with? Nothing. I'll guard you. Bless you, sweetheart. Okay. I've already left gold in here, Vilkas. Don't ask me to leave anymore. All right. Ring of Major Smithing. Major Smithing. Yes. So, lots of good loot. This is a really good DLC. I like this DLC a lot. Um, it does have a lot to offer. Uh, and a ton more gameplay. So. Oh! Look at that, if we wouldn't have taken that bowl, we wouldn't have got all that loot. It pays to be a hoarder sometimes. Let's see if there's anything that we can disenchant. Get out of our inventory quick. Ring of the night. Oh. You know what? I am gonna disenchant it. It would help us. But I can put that I can put that enchantment on something else at a later time. I'm not going to wear this because I have the Ring of Hercene. So, what we need to do is make a left-handed... Oh, no, I can't get back out of that. Water's too deep. A left-handed enchanted ring for all the other goodies. Back to Blood Skull Barrow. wants to go back in there apparently. All right. Reavers. Reavers are bad. Reavers are bad. They're like bandits back in Skyrim. Oh man, I thought I was all quiet like. I'm not lost. Ah, too close. Ooh, Reaver Lord's got some skills. 
maybe I can just eat apple pies. Um, we'll eat some bread. Ooh! Oh, that's Magicka. Magicka's not gonna help me right now. Oh, my health is full. What am I doing? Goodness. Vilkas, get in here. Okay. Um, home cooked meal. Ah. Perfect. Alright, give me the grilled leeks. Honey nut treats. Oh, I wanted to save those for the kids. Okay, we'll say long taffy treats for kids. There we go. Uh, rabbit hunch, steaks, seared slaughter fish, sweet rolls. No one's taking my sweet rolls. Yes, Vilkas! You savage! He is so savage. I love him. Okay. Anything? Oh, thank you. Oh, you're so good. You have really come around as an ex... What is that? Oh. I was like, why... Are you no longer holding that torch for me? Oh! Oh, guys! Uh... Oh god. I got one in! Oh, and he still gave me so much credit. That's so cute. It's like, we showed them. You did everything, but we showed them. Alright, let's get all this stuff. Oh! Oh, it's all full! Oh, that one was empty. Wine, wine, no empty. I'll take the wine. See, they're not total winos, because they, they left some undrunk. But it's wine. It'd be nice if it was like a moose drool or a Guinness or something. Be awesome. Oh, let me get all these books quick. Alright, I cleared it all out. There wasn't anything special, but then let's look in the chest. Cool. Alright, let's rock and roll. Vilky baby. It's very dark in here. Why do you have a torch? He's just chilling. Oh no. Oh, that's so bad. They're just. It, are, it doesn't say burnt Draugr, it says burnt corpse, so. Oh. Oh. I see airway. That means, uh oh. High Elf and Imperial. These guys have no shame, I say as I'm looting their bodies. So same! The niche. Look at these stones. The ancestors knew how to build, no doubt. Anybody coming after me? Okay, you take care of that one. Oh, I see you. Oops. Okay, you're pushing me and I don't much like it. Oh, that one 
in my face. Get him, Velkas! He's not even it. He's not even attacking him, Vilkas. Oh, was I hitting Vilkas? Oh my god, I'm so bad. Ah, oh, that was awesome. Excellent. Well done. Yee, don't knock me off here. Okay. All right. First, we loot up top, and then we'll work down to ground level. We can walk the tops here. A Dunmer outfit. Cool. Worker tusk. Trap. Aw, oh, man. I was hoping that was some kind of... Oh, Sujama. Four side. Four side. It's so good! Okay. While there's a tanning rack sitting right in front of us, I'm going to turn all of my hides into leather. Oh, that was puny. Oh, that's right, because I dropped everything off at the house before we embarked on our journey. I did that. I did that. Ew, the chitin helmets. The chitin armor the bone mold armor. I'm just, n I've never been a fan. I'm sure, reclamations. What are all these books doing over here? <sighs> They're just messy. They're messy, messy peeps. Um, I want to jump over the top. I want to go from the top. Do, 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 do. <laughs> oh, there's one more bad guy out there. Note to Marin. Look, Marin, I'm not arguing that these towers are falling to pieces, but I think you are exaggerating about the fl flanks falling on. <laughs> Chain lightning. That's funny. I would sleep, but I wouldn't be getting any kind of resting bonuses because we're wolves. You know what? I want to test a theory. I want to see if I get Nordic carved armor. I do love the Nordic carved armor. I'm pretty sure we don't get any kind of resting bonus, but did not want to, oh, wrong button. I did not want to be here yet. I did not realize, well now we've discovered that, which is perfect, which means you don't have to travel the entire way. I want to go back here, because I didn't loot at all, but <laughs> again, we're going to oogle over the voice of, of Mirak later. I have, I have a plan. Get her! Get her! Ah, get her! I had to take a swing too. You were just too quick, Vilkas. Okay. This buzzing. Weird. Buzzing things. Anywho, okay. What in the what in the world was I even saying? I have no idea what I was saying when this, uh, oh, yeah, um, oh, there's something right over there, oh, I heard that unmistakable noise, um, I wanted to see if, I know you don't get any resting bonuses as far as the reg, 
the regular bonus, but what about the um, 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 um being married sleeping bonus? Do you still get that, or is that a giant no too? Anywho, that's all. I was just trying to see if um, you were able to get that bonus or it's just you don't get anything if you're a wolf. It's okay either way. I just was wondering that. Okay. Well, I'm now wondering if I sleep any time will I be sent to Merak's temple. Or was it just that first time? Now my inquiring mind must know. It's gonna send me back every single time? Yeah, that's right. Oh wait, did it send me to a different one, or is this still... Where the heck am I now? Oh! Well, this would be an excellent way to get all of the, um... stones discovered. Just sleep a whole bunch till they're all discovered. Nice! That way I can just fast travel. That is so... convenient. No. Let's, so let's fast travel back here. I'll just pop. Oh, that's a different dragon. Fine. Alright, let's hop in another bed here really quick and see what other place we get teleported to. Because I really wouldn't mind discovering every single one of those. Wasn't there a bedroll up here? It was right here. Yeah, I don't mind bad. We can't read these getting them all discovered real quick. Beast stone. Look at these cute little wrinklings! Oh, crap! Oh, you are a poop. Ah, Vilkas is here now. You're in trouble. Okay. Oh, there was one right close right there. Interesting. Okay, let's go back. The Reekling Hut. Oh, excuse me, Thirst Mead Hall. It's still the Reekling Hut. Um, let's just go this way instead. I think it'll be faster. All right. So I don't remember. I I don't remember how many there are. But let's get this figured out. Earthstone. I already know Earthstone. Okay. Not a problem. Vilkas, over here, baby. Whoa. Alright. So now we can give back, um, the oh no he's not at work right now we can give back the um, pickaxe is it a dragon I'll see you it's a 
dragon! Earth dragon. Very flighty. Would you stop moving for a minute? Well, did what I told him to do. Darn him. Alright, we'll go talk to this guy first. And then... Dude, do you not recognize me? Hi! I'm back! Okay! You were right all along. Let me see that. Okay. Huh, I knew it. Gratian's death wasn't because of a rock fall, mm -mm. it was just a story to keep people away from the tombs. Now that I have his journal in hand, I can get some closure from the East Empire Company. Make them pay for lying to everyone. No doubt. Good luck with that. Thank you. Now, I believe I owe you a little more than a debt of gratitude for all that work you Here, it's not much, but it's the best an old retired monk can do. That's so nice. Okay, um... Mark my word. Raven Rock isn't finished. Uh-uh. Let's go kill this dragon. If he's gonna come over here anywheres. Doesn't look like it. Is the blacksmith out yet? No. Excuse me. How did I... How did I make a whole bunch of people up there angry with just my one little arrow? We gotta figure out what to make with this stuff. Oh, you're back! Or not. We're gonna have to run up there, aren't we? Alright, let's go. I'm stuck. Why is the fight music gone away? When I finally travel up here to take care Did you guys kill the dragon or Dang son Thank you You guys are pretty awesome Dragonborn What is that? A were bear Oh no Dang So you guys know me as Dragonborn. Thank you. That's odd. I don't think that was supposed to have happened. Sorry, I'm just remembering stuff. Okay, anyways, no worries. Okay, now let's head back down and try to fast forward a little bit of time to talk to the blacksmith and get that done. Good lord, there's a lot of you guys. No wonder the dragon bit it so quick. Okay, what time is it? 9.55 p.m. Look and see if there's anything in here we have not eaten. Saw that paralysis. I don't know what that was. Okay. All right. Well, let's see if we can make some health potions. Uh, 
Bummer. Well, there's regenerate health. That's better than nothing. Okay. Not quite what I was hoping for. But that's okay. I think that's him right there. Hello. Mm. Mm -hmm. my pickaxe yet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a good thing going here now that you've reopened the mines. Don't let it go to waste. All right, um, I have your ancient Nordic pickaxe. So, you finally tracked down old Crescius, eh? Yeah. Quite a character, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> tell you what, since you went through all the trouble of finding it for me and all, you keep it. After all that, why? I just wanted to remind that codger you can't just go around taking things from other people. Now that you've delivered the message, I'm satisfied. Besides, that pickaxe hasn't done me any good in years. Maybe you can put it to good use. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. Oh! Bring your weapons and armor to me. Glover Mallory's the name. If you're looking for a smith, you found one of the best. Excellent. How'd you end up in Raven Rock? A fine question, and the one that I hear most often from visitors to our town. I wish I had a more romantic tale to tell. But I was simply seeking my fortune and chose Raven Rock to ply my trade. Besides, knowing how to repair bone mold armor wasn't very useful in Riften. Who taught you that? I had a friend over there, a dark elf named Van Rife, a very talented armor smith. Spent a lot of time with the guy swapping smithing techniques. Learned a heck of a lot, including how to repair bone mold. After he moved on to greener pastures, I decided to pack up, move out here, and put those lessons to the test. Been here ever since. Ah. Okay, so we're going to have to remember Glover Mallory from Riften. Bring your weapons and armor to me. I'll fix it up right. Awesome. Somebody sniffing me? Are you sniffing me? What is that? Very creepy is what that is. Anywho, okay, so this is our ancient Nordic pickaxe. We must f favorite that. Okay. So we can unfavorite these. So we can get rid of the normal pickaxes now. Because this one will do everything the other one will do, plus skull, stall room, excuse me, stall room, and yeah, that's good. That's really, really good. Okay, so I think that's going to be it for this episode. Next episode, we are going to leave Raven Rock and actually go adventuring in this direction. So... We went through and found the Blood Skull Blade, which is not up to par with Ruthrod, so I'm not going to give it to Vilkas, but you know who I think will enjoy it? Vilkas' brother. As soon as I can get my smithing up high enough to get the improve enchanted items, then I can improve it a little bit, Blood and... If you're looking for a smith, you found one of the best. And Take then we can uh, bump it up a little bit, make it a little bit more powerful. All right. So anyways, I'm going to finish selling off all our extra goodies here. And yeah, we'll see you in the next one when we head out of Raven Rock and explore the tundra. All righty. We'll see you later.